Alright, what is up dudes? Welcome back to Small Pokemon X. And we're going to explore this town a little bit because we've not looked around here yet. Hi, Voltsy. An acquaintance of yours. Two visitors to the Shabonui Castle. I can't remember the last time we've been so busy. <laughs> busy for two people. This castle, Chateau if you will, was a manor house of a noble family. Maybe a little rundown? That's because there's history to this place. During that history, the owners of this castle gave away a lot of their stuff to everyone. So that's why it feels so empty. The end. That's it. Do you have anything related to Mega Evolution? What's it? What's in the world is a Mega Evolution? <laughs> Sir, it's back again. Is it this time of year already? Well, there's nothing I can do about that now. Need to go to Route 7, but please. Take your time and have a look around. I wonder what that's about. Why don't we go to Route 7 too? Alright, at least we know where we're heading next. Let's look around this uh, chateau, see what we can find in here. Bound to be an item or two somewhere. Let's check this little place here first. Escape rope. Cool, cool. Can we read these books? No. I kind of hope it'll be like uh, the mansion in Cinnabar Island. Read all the uh, diary entries, they were really interesting. There's a big bed, which I can't sleep in. Rats. Alright, let's uh, go to the right. Oh, it's actually not that big. Well, I kind of sucked. Okay, what else can we look around this town? Uh, should we enter some buildings? Talk to some people? Might be a good idea. Find some information on Mega Evolutions. Whoa! Looks crazy. Yo, how's it going there? Um, Cassius, check this out. You know what I'm doing here? I'm keeping the PC box running so... No, seriously. Bill over in Kanto asked me to come here and run things for real. Enough with the introductions. Get out there, catch some Pokemon, and put them in the PC. Yo, you got something you want to ask me? I ain't got all day, you know. I'm good. Alright, so he's the guy. Take this thief. Alright. <laughs> yeah, he's filling in for, uh, for Bill. That's pretty cool. I wonder if Professor um, Oak's going to be in this game. I'm pretty sure Bill and Oak are mentioned or talked about in every game. Not too sure on that, but I know Professor Oak's been in every single one except for Emerald, I think. I'm kind of thinking, I think Emerald's probably the. Oh, the sore thumb. What's this? Welcome to the hotel... I, I don't know how to pronounce this town. Camp... Campair, I guess? Campier? The owner, doorman, concierge. Bellhop, the housekeeping staff. And right now, I'm the cook. Yeah, I don't really want to enter the uh, hotel. Let's get that item to the left. It looks like I have to go from the top. Oh, God, I keep crashing into stuff. Exotech. I still have the uh, X stuff. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Now, what house didn't have we ended? I think it was this one. I didn't go in. Sup? Today, electric type Pokemon are giving off good vibes. Please show me electric type Pokemon. Yes? Oh, I've got to have it on me. Damn it! If you catch a Pokemon that's electric type, please show it to me. I'll give you a little something. I could get Pikachu out of the box and. Sweetheart, nice. Medicine pocket, cool, cool. Yeah, I'm gonna get Pikachu out of the box and come back here and uh, see what that guy wants to give me. There's a good thing about new Pokemon games, like you walk into this house, talk to people, you have no idea what to expect. Actually, I want that. There was a um, that sixth gen electric type, the normal electric, I think it was. I want that on my team. Looks pretty cool. Oh no, not deposit, I want to um, withdraw. Uh, get Sparky. Alright, let's go talk to the guy again. And get our free gift. I know we'll come back here after and put Pikachu back in the box. It's going to be a pain in the ass, but... Might be worth it. Well, I hope it's worth it anyway. Today, Electric Type are giving a good flies. Please show me Electric Type. There you go. There's my Pikachu. 
Oh, you got one. I'm putting off great vibes. A berry. You give me a goddamn berry after all that. I was going to hope it would be like <laughs> at least a TM. Alright, that's not worth it then. Never doing that again. Oh, I hate that guy so much. Could have got something good, but nope. A goddamn berry. <laughs> Tricked me. Alright, sorry Pikachu. Uh, oh god, do not really want to use you. Ready then, let's head to uh, Route 7. See what the commotion's about. Uh, it's got to be this way, I think. Let's talk to this dude, he's kind of just on the edge of town. Shabo Nui Castle may look pretty different to you than it does to me. We are different people, after all. Well, you don't say. This goes to Route 6, I kind of want to go Route 6. Foxy, they said they were going this way. I might want to explore Route 6. Damn it. Now, what's down this way? Oh, hello. Hey, mister, this way, this way. You. I know this is an unexpected request, but I need you to take care of my berry field. Berries are great. One berry can produce more berries. I assure you that your love field work. Who wants to give it a try? Oh, great. Uh, oh, your name is Hayden. Thank you, Hayden. Hooray! That's great, Grandpa. I must teach you how to take care of the field right away. Please follow me. Plant a berry in the soft soil. Check the soil if you want to plant a berry. Got some orange berries. Very good. Some peach berries. And a sprinkler tad. Alright. Now you run off, and I'm gonna run off too. Uh, maybe I should plant berry or two, I guess. Let's plant orange berry, why not? There you go, I'm good. Let's go. <laughs> not too much into the berry planting right now. So I'm probably doing the. Oh, it's Snorlax! Fawlty, what is it? I think there's a daycare just up there as well. Here we go again. It's sleeping so soundly. And the world wouldn't wake it. Look, it's practically a mountain, right? It's blocking the road completely. Come now, sir. Use the poker flute. Oh wait, do you even have it anymore? Nope, I handed it over. Or you could say it was taken by the owner of the palace. What, huh? What's a poker flute? Basically, the poker flute is what we need to wake up Snorlax. The poker flute is currently at Parfum Palace. Oh, that's it. All we need to do is get it then. Come on, let's go. Parfum Palace is just past Route 6. I thought it was going in the first place. Alrighty then. So look at the friends as well. It seems that she's going to be in the Mega Evolutions. Serena's going to be your rival. Uh, the little geeky kid's going to be uh, the Pokedex guy. And the big fat guy's going to be the dancer, I guess. Can we go through here? Oh, nice. Night I'm here as well. X special attack. Tall grass, expect to find loads of Pokemon in here. Can't actually go into it. Might have to go in through the uh This place is huge! Jesus. Can I actually get in that way? Damn it. Well let's talk to this guy or battle him, whatever. This Palace? Palace Lane actually has two different faces. One is the easiest stroll here, and the other is well. Guess you'll find out about the on your way back from the palace. Whoa, that looks interesting. Oh, there's music! So great! But you thought I was just some unassuming tourist. Kind to be a seasoned battler, too. Well, I'll be the judge of that. Whoa, damn! You just got <laughs> really hideous. I do apologize. Got Pikachu, what level is it? Is it no match for my Charmeleon? Level 11, yep. Oh god, these enemies are pretty easy. Oh no, not quick attack. 
Yeah, Dragon Rage. Very good. Psyduck, yeah, I'm gonna switch. Oh, nice. Didn't know Psyduck had that ability. What is Force Palm it? Who knows, might get the uh, paralyzation off. Or just kill it in one hit. That's good enough for me. Got Pidgey as well. Oh, I should have switched, damn it. That was an accident. Oh well, we'll just kill it with uh, quick attacks. Oh, that's going to do a bit of damage. Eh, actually, not that much. What? Sorry, Grandma. Um, just that good. Next trainer. Why do I travel? Why do I battle? Allow me to demonstrate. Go ahead. Zigzagoon. Yeah, free Pokemon. Guess level ten. And do 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 eleven. Yeah, that's fair enough. I kind of want to fight enemies like level 15-ish. Just, it's too easy. So overleveled. Got a Rolts. Oh, okay. Looks pretty badass. Doesn't affect... Oh god, it's fairy type now, isn't it? Oh god. Dragon Rage won't work on that. Let's just Ember it. Totally forgot Rod's got classed as uh, <laughs> for the burn off though. Oh, oh, good. <laughs> the new, I love that new feature in this game. Like fire Pokemon can't be burnt, electric can't be uh, paralyzed. Oh god, synchronization. That was just perfect. Get Ember burn synchronization doesn't affect. Yeah, so good. And then what you got last? Reach level 21. A gulpin. Eh, we're staying. And we're Dragon Rage it. Did you see your Pokemon smile just now? Yep, I did. Got a big smile on my face as well. Wow, this place looks pretty big. Half-Moon Palace. Oh, there's an item down there. Aoife! I wonder if I can battle these trainers around here. Probably can, I'm guessing. I can't even talk to this dude. Old buildings more important than people who are alive now? I guess so. Hey, trainer. Yes, you. Young man, I'll share an orange berry with you. What is the level of everyone giving me orange berries? So many. Yeah, anything around here? What is one of them picture things? Uh, yes, I do. Let's get a picture done. Hey, what do you want to do? Uh, take a photo. Oh, I can just do it myself. I want to, uh, oh god. It's kind of hard when you've got like four cables out of your 3DS and you're not even like, looking at it. How do I zoom out? Okay, let me look at the DS. I want to make this perfect. I should go look at the 3D, I should go press the button, damn it. Then all the settings right here.
I wasn't looking, no. No, look at the camera. There we go. That's a great photo. Bit, bit tilted, but I can't do any better. War cable is kind of restricting me. You gonna go uh, give a tip? Yeah, no, I'm good. <laughs> oh god. Anyway, let's try in here and get the poker flute back. The entrance fee will be one thousand poker dollars per person. You've got to be kidding! It costs money to go inside. You see, the owner of the palace follows the school of thought. You can never have too much money. Yeesh! That's how the rich get richer. Here's your entrance fee, one thousand dollars. Oh God! I don't know, no, no. I'd rather leave the Snorlax there and just. God damn it! That thousand is for my clothes and. Swag fun fund. Ah, thousand dollars just to enter a goddamn mansion. It's disgraceful. She can't go left or right. Stuck on this little platform. There's a melodic, and um, is that Bishops? Where could it be? My Furfro! My beloved little Furfro has disappeared! It disappeared? Hey Voltsy, we should help look. I mean, if my if my Pokemon was missing, I'd be sick with worry. Alright then, let's go look for it. Giant dog. Well, not really giant, but... It's bound to be somewhere. Damn, this is actually huge! Uh, let's try upstairs. Here, yeah, doggy doggy, where are you? That's a marrow. How about we trade your uh, your dog for a mouse? Might be a little bit better. Ooh, poke wall there, I'll have to steal this. Amulet coin. Get up to a Pokemon to hold, get some uh, more monies. Actually, I might do that now. So I could use some money. Alright, uh, we'll give it to... Uh, give it to Frogadier, because Charmeleon and uh, Riola will eventually hold the Mega Stones, won't they? There's no point actually giving them items to hold at the moment. Uh, not this way. This is a stupid dog. Wow, this looks pretty awesome. Yeah, doggy doggy. Ooh, painting. Portrait of someone on the wall. Perhaps it's the king who built this place. Horrible painting. <laughs> looks terrible. Dog has got to be somewhere. Well, it's not on this floor. Maybe some of the rooms we missed on the bottom floor. Damn, it's not. Oh, wait, is that? No, that's a girl. I thought like a little girl was part of the dog then. I was going to say, there it is. You look different. I am travelling minstrel. Minstrel, <laughs> wonder in the world. Uh, now I'm pound, ancient days, an ugly past, don't bear. The woes of war did knock on every door, till man nor Pokemon could take no more. Three thousand years ago upon this shore. Would you like to give a tip? No! Your poem sucked. Oh, wow. So that's the thing from the trailer. I know we're seeing this. So the dog must be here somewhere. Have a look in the back. 
Alrighty then, the dog's in the garden somewhere. You're gonna wanna battle the TM just there. Oh, HMO cut! You just find cut line up, or HM line about, that's cool, I guess. Can now cut some trees down, there's an item there. Can I see I thought it was connected to the internet. Nope, I'll do that another time. Oh god, this maze is gonna confuse me. Oh, I can't go on the outside of it. Eh, it's not cool. Okay, I think this side might be done. Yep. Go away, it keeps telling me to go to the internet. I don't want to connect to the internet. Oh, is that a pickable? Empty dote. I mean, it's like 10 past 4 in the morning. I'm not gonna <laughs> want to connect in there and battle people now, am I? To start the game, I'm gonna enjoy it first. Giant pickable statue, it's pretty cool. Oh god. Wait, might be a pokeball item around here somewhere. It's one thing I do hate. Oh wow. Oh, Zekrom. Why have they got a statue of Zekrom here? That's pretty awesome. Oh, there it is. Don't you dare run away. Damn it! Please don't run away. Forty, give me a hand. Part of there leads to a dead end. Let's split up and chase Furfro and corner it. Alright, alright. And I'll just put you here. Alright. I have no idea how I'm going to do this. And Damn it. <laughs> right, let's move you. Can I put you anywhere? Because that would be great. Right, we're gonna put you put you here, and you've got to run. Yeah, that's what I'm trying to do. Alright, so if I'm there, then I can maybe put you in the middle. Uh, if you put there, you, we can't can go up. Why are you annoying? Wait here. Damn it. Ah, this is so annoying. Okay, now you're going up this way. Okay, now I need to get you. Top right. Oh, top left doesn't really matter which way I put you. I'll just put you up here. Well, if I actually put you here then. So you can't come down this way. And I come this way. And, uh, it'd be, it makes sense if she just went... Oh, and we can just got her really easy. There you go. Whew, well done. We finally caught it. Rodzi, you're amazing. Caught it because you understand how Pokemon feel. Would have caught it a lot easier if you just followed my instructions and said, No, I want to be here. Oh, my dear Furfru. My beloved Furfru. Could you two be responsible for my wonder, uh, Wonderfrau reunion with my dear Furfrau? How wonderful. Wonderfrau, indeed. It's marvellous. Simply marvellous. situation like this demands fireworks. We shall put on a show. Boom boom! My Pokemon and I are reunited. Our bond has been proven. We're commemorate 
the, this joyous occasion with a tremendous fireworks display. It will also serve a reward for the tiny bit of trouble you went to. Rendezvous at the balcony. Do you understand? Rendezvous? You can reach the balcony from the hall with the mirrors on the second floor. I understand rendezvous. If I were a Pokemon, I'd hate to have a trainer like that. But I really love fireworks, so let's make the best of it. I can also say I do like fireworks. Now you stay here and I'll enjoy the fireworks. Ah, let's go. All the way back. I was going a straight line down, that'd be great. Oh, damn it. Yeah, that's how close it was there. Ah, wow. Alright, second floor balcony with the mirrors. And let's go up. Where are the stairs? I think that's far right. There they are. The room with the mirrors. I think I know what he's talking about. I think it's this bit right here. And you beat me to it. Um, you know, never watched fireworks alone with a boy before. Oh, don't make this weird. Come on. We haven't seen them yet, but I know I'll never forget these fireworks. So I watched them with you, Hayden. Oh, that music was really cool. Well, that was nice. Wow, that was amazing. Never ever want to forget this, so I'll keep this memory in an album in my heart. And that was my wonderful fireworks show for my fur fowl. I assume you're satisfied with that? Oh! I almost forgot. The poker flute. That's right, we need the poker flute to wake up Snorlax. I was rushing around there, I, just, I didn't even notice, I just saw Zekrom. <laughs> so get it. It was Shabba Nui Castle's treasure, but I took it as a payment for a loan. A rich guy like me and a common person like that just didn't go together. Give it to them. Here is the poker flute. Think you're my good man? Listen well, you two. Always return what you borrow. That's very important. I'm going to keep this. I want to make lots of memories on my journey, but I think I'll try and forget about him. Can't imagine how stressful running this place is for him. Uh, maybe so, but oh, that's right, Mr. Butler. Do you know anything? Do you know anything about Mega Evolution? I remember reading a book on the subject in the Palace Library. It has something to do with what you'd what you'd now call a trainer holding a mysterious stone, high and making Pokémon evolve even further. Also, it's not much, but I'd like you to have this. TM17. Very good. Protects blocks opposing Pokemon, uh, but if you use it many times in a row, the chance of it not working increase. If you'll excuse me, I shall take my leave. The owner of Shabuni Castle used to be friends with that guy. Can you believe it? Isn't that crazy? You have to be sure to give that flute back after we make, wake up Snorlax. Now nah, I'm going to keep the flute. Borrow this part right here, and I'll see you next time. Peace. <laughs>